Hello, it's your boy from 1996. Welcome back to the episode of Low Standards. In this episode, we'll be tackling Mega Man X, the original Super Nintendo version. However, I'm playing this on the Anniversary Collection on the PS2. Let's just say, uh, things went to shit for me in my abilities to play in this game because I'm very bad at this game. This is evidence that you notice that I have the, uh, we're not in the opening stage and I don't have, um... I don't have, I, I currently have the dash boots on. It's because I was trying to go through this originally, I went to uh, two separate recordings, but then shit got real, as in like, I sucked. Ah! I'm gonna be angry about the entirety of both this and my next episode, no doubt. Because I am bad at SNES Mega Man, this is a proven, given my experience playing the, uh, the mobile version. Oh my god. Go away! I think the reason why I'm so annoyed in the progress of trying to beat this is that you don't have uh, that much health. Unlike most Mega Man games, it at least gives you a, a considerable amount of health. You have to find hard takes in order to progressively get your health to be a lot more, so that way you can survive battles. Yeah, that, I think it's armor pieces that increases your health in the process. Doesn't really make any sense, because uh, without those, I have been dying easily to the bosses since their health meter uh, health bars are way bigger than mine I guess in the one drop I got what the f these enemies get spawning everywhere Ugh! I might just have to go and resort to cheating fully and just gain the full armor because the only way I can get all the hard tanks in order to survive this whole thing I don't know hard tanks count as increasing health, or hard tanks count as, um, you know, like, E-Tanks back in the original Mega Man games. But I am dying like the Dickens. These enemies are, like, the worst. I know enemies can be annoying in Mega Man games, but this takes the freaking cake. And this is only, like, what, the first stage of the, of the Maverick to fight against? The fact that I start with so little health makes no sense. I mean, I understand the ideal concept because you're trying to be strong, like Zero asks you to, at the start of the game. But fuck me, I, I, I'm bad! And I grew up with these kind of platformers. I shouldn't be this bad. But somehow time has just regressed for me entirely. Just realized I could just jump over this whole shit. Okay, never mind. Can't jump over the ship for some reason. Because, you know, the game doesn't like being nice. No, fuck off. <laughs> Bitch. No! Fuck you. The last thing I need is to not lose my lives. Okay, gotta be careful and charge up. Here comes the snowball shit. The one thing that perplexed me during my previous attempts to record this episode is why the hell the Snowball's hair X? Isn't he like made of like a super strong like metal or some or like some kind of like strong alloy or some shit? And somehow Snowball's is what's causing him to die. It's fucking Snowball's. Does every single one of these mechanoloids just have rocks in these things? Or is it we reach a part of the future where snow somehow has gained a much more denser shape to the point of full-on concussion-like injuries? Okay, I didn't lose any of my lives so far. The one thing I gotta deal with in terms of trying to beat this is not losing lives. Fucking chill penguin, bring it! Oh my god, we are already starting off great. Stop laughing at me. One day I'll get this right. Ah, oh my god. I'm so bad at my timing. Oh, 
I didn't know I can do that. I, I I played X4 for the longest time. I didn't know you can do this. Wow. Um. I I, I clearly did not know how to play these platformers. There we go, finally. Uh, I think with that, I might have a bit of smooth sailing as we as we can progress. Can't words. Do, 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 do. When I, honestly, when I hear this song, the first thing I think of is uh, Gerard the Completionist. Because that used to be his opening, like a remix of uh, the songs for his opening. You got shotgun ice. Now I can save and actually feel more progressive on how to progress. Turn the game. All right, now we have shotgun knights. It's time to literally break the system by doing a uh, spark mantle stage. Yo, the song be cool. The song is lit. Everyone knew when they first played this game that spark mantle music rocks. Ouch. Fucking ah. Oh, son of a Hey ah. Oh no, I, I fell for that. I, this happened to me before during back then on the iPad episode. Oh, fuck you. Ah, how am I? I shouldn't even be hurt by these things. Oh my god, I keep landing on them like it's a, like it's required to. Oh my god. You know what? Forget shotgun ice everything. Wait, what's the point of this room? If it's just gonna be a dead end! Oh my god. Ah, I hate these things. Come on! Lovely. <laughs> Whatever, I'll save. I mean, there's no point really, I'm just wasting time, but that's gonna always appear if I keep losing. Can we get it? Destroy those things. Son of a No. 
No. Right weird how they just, you know, like, okay, now the area is clear of uh, these guys. Oh, goody. Oh, mode seven. Ah. There we go. Big boss defeated. Oh my god, you can just dash you you double tap it. Like in the control stick, I mean. Okay. <laughs> Oh, shit. No. No, I was just trying to get my... Okay, that's just my, my first life of life. <laughs> yes, an extra life. Perfect. Oh, shit. Son of a... Fuck you. Ah! Uh, fucking turrets. There's something on Mega Man 1. Oh shit, I'm out of shotgun dice. Oh shit! Perfect! Oh, I have this guy. I don't listen to him because of uh, Mega Man uh, Command Mission. Along with the freaking rodent hog things. Ah, oh, not these things again. Alright, I don't know if I have enough shotgun dice to deal with spark mandrels, but as long as I know the pattern, I think I know what to do. Ouch. Uh. 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 Spark Bandra. You explode now. to Armored Armadillo. Do, 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 
That was close. We lost our momentum there for a second. Whew. Gotta get ice more often in order to destroy multiple enemies. Damn it. Woo, that was close. Gotta take this with me. Fuck you. Ouch. Ah, fucking, fucking meta bats. I don't know what their names actually are. Fuck you. Get this. Ugh. Red R's. Joke's on you, losers. Whee! I think they're called bat bones. I don't actually remember the exact names. Okay. Oh, I thought I was going to... Oh, well. Probably should have gotten in front of me in order to get that uh, heart tank. Ouch! Don't you laugh at me. Oh shit! <laughs> I was thinking I was supposed to ride that cart all the way there. I think that was the downside of the whole not going in that cart. Wait a minute, that means <gasps> I try going over here. No! Let's try it again. Switch to shotgun. Oh, for fuck's sake, idiot. Ouch. There we go.
did it again. Okay, there's no way I can really go in front of it. Unless I'm supposed to destroy it before I reach it there. Alright, well I just wasted all my weapon energy like an idiot. Fucking momentum. There we go. Oh my god. Ugh. Yes, finally. More health. Oh, that worked. Okay, I have to jump exactly at the point right before near the edge. Alright, on to armored armadillo. Hello. I have more health. Oh, fuck. Nope! I was. Uh. Oh, wait, that was not my last life. That was my last life. Well, at least I got that heart tank. So many enemies. Yes, I need this. Yes, more lives. Fuck you, game. Oh, slow. No. no. At least to do it this way, I don't need to have to ride it again. I only need to get this, but I'll take it anyways. Oops, that's all I want to do. What the fu- what even hit me? There we go. Now we're more adept. And also I have extra lives. Ooh!
All right, bring it on. Ouch. Oh my god. What the fuck? You just took out like half of my health. Oh my god. Oh my god. This boss fight's gonna take me a lifetime and a half just to try to beat. Of lives, which are all gonna get run out pretty easily. Okay. Oh my god, why does he take so much health? No! Fuck this, I'm out. 